You're listening to Truly Unruly with Marcus and Jessica Trufant. Welcome back, y'all. Took a week off. What's up, True Fonts? How we doing? Hey, hey, hey. Good, doing well, good. man. How are you, Kel? I am good. Truly good. Unruly, episode eight. How was the holiday? How was Thanksgiving? It was nice. I mean, it yeah. was different, but it was, it was nice. Yeah. It was nice. I still overate. Yeah. I always overeat, and, uh, but it was good. I yeah. mean, it was different, but good, so yeah. You throw down, Jess? All the time. Nice. Are you talking about cooking or eating? Because both. Cooking. Cooking. Oh. Both. Did he help or did you do everything by yourself? Um, well, what he did do, he decided, I see my wife in here working hard. So he figured out how to make the best strawberry martinis, went to the store, started whipping them up, and now you're like a mixologist. It's or something my thing like that. now. It's just yeah. a thing I do now. Oh, yeah. are you so I'm a bartender in training now. So, you know, I, I, uh, martinis. For the ladies on uh, Thanksgiving, and um, I'm a Moscow Mule guy too, so I do that too. So right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, it takes 45 yeah, yeah, yeah. minutes to an hour, but quality over yeah. quantity. So worth yeah. it. Yes, nice. Mm-hmm. That's good. Yeah. All right, we're at episode eight. Last time we chat, we talked about you guys' proposal. Um, now we're gonna get into the nitty gritty. We're gonna get into this wedding. Uh, because Snap. off camera, we've had a couple discussions about this wedding. <laughs> and let me tell y'all, this True Font wedding was off the hook. It went down. It, it definitely went down. went down. Okay, so first question. Mm-hmm. I'm throwing this out there. Whoever wants to answer it first. How soon after the proposal was the wedding? Mm. Do you know? Absolutely not. So It uh, was like a year okay. after. That's yeah. not bad, right? Yeah, that, a year that's, planning. That's, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Okay. Hella planning at that. Yes. Right? Yeah. Now, was the wedding party big, small? It was out of control, actually. What is it? Was it nine bridesmaids, nine groomsmen, yeah. ten grooms? Something, cr- something ridiculous. Yes. Now, did you plan it all yourself, Jess? Or were you taking ideas from other folks? Or Shout out to Mary Beth, the best. Well, she's not a wedding planner anymore, but... The best wedding planner ever, event event planner ever. She like came through, kept us on track, gave us great ideas. I didn't take some of them, Um, but yeah, I wasn't listening to anybody else actually. Whose wedding did she do before? Or did she do somebody's before ours, and we kind of got to look at hers? I can't remember how we found her or how you found her. I I don't remember. Okay. No, no, she did somebody back then. Player, ex player, somebody. Player? I think so. I can't remember okay. though. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Um, were you a bridezilla at all during this prep, the preparation time? Were there times where you just kind of freaked out or had meltdowns? Well, personally, I think I was great. I might have gotten a little bridezilla ish when it came to like certain details, like my bridesmaids' dresses, which. Once again, I would like to apologize to you guys for doing that to you. I should have listened. I am so sorry. My bad. We're going to post some videos. We got some pictures. Oh, we got a wedding book. Oh, man. We're going to take a couple snaps. What, of, did, what, did, what, what did she do to these bridesmaids about these dresses? Were you like Ho Chi Minh or something? Like, what happened? Well. What, my, Genghis our, Khan? Our, our, our colors were... Silver, pink, white, black, right? And so I wanted all my bridesmaids to wear metallic silver dresses. And they really tried when we're at the place and we're looking at, and they're like, well, well why don't you try this softer gray? I'm like, no. You guys are going to look like Michelin moon men, and that is it. So... um so it looked like the Mo Money Mo Problems music video. Ooh, yeah. shiny suit. Shiny suit. Shiny like a bad, suit. bad boy video Take circa that. 1990. They looked like a big old like industrial sized foil. Ooh. So Rack. Missy Elliott, I can't stand the rain. Yep. The big, but big, not a black, but, yeah. but silver. But foil. Tin man, they like wow. everything shiny and wrong. They look like that. 
And once again, I should have listened. <laughs> I mean, I can't believe it. I can't believe At it. At the time, though, I'm going to give you a little bit more credit than that. One of my bridesmaids was like nine months pregnant. So just imagine having metallic. At the time, we was fresh, though. Now, looking back, it's like, damn. But In hindsight. Yeah, we was fresh in it. Like the, the, the silver metallic with the hot pink right. um, tie. Yeah, kind of what, fuchsia hot pink. You couldn't yeah. tell me shit, pretty much. Hey. Okay, you guys got married 2006? Right. That's yeah, a lie. I'm sorry. Metallic <laughs> Silver wasn't in in 2006. What was it? Two, no, 2005. No. Oh shoot. Eight. 2007. 2008. That's even worse. Seven I'm gonna sound like a, a hater, but 2008 Metallic was definitely. I not guess everybody in. was being nice, though. Nobody said nothing about it, though. Everybody was like, "Yeah." No, they tried. Like I said, they uh, gave me like gentle suggestions that I was like, "Whack." But see, no one you wanted to ruin her day. Yeah, You're not nah. in the wedding type thing. Oh, you were like that? No. <laughs> Marcus. <laughs> okay, so well, well, what were the best parts of the, 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 the uh, preparation part of the wedding? Like, were there good parts? Were there parts you're like, wow, like this is really dope? For no? me, uh, um, I know from the groom's point of view, uh, it's not really my wedding. You know what I'm saying? So I'm I'm there to support and uh, just make sure everything goes smooth. I'm not into the the to the to the uh, flash and this. If I would have had it my way, the wedding would have looked a lot different. Not that that's good or bad, but just being me and my personality, I didn't need the 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 glass. We would have been sculpture. In a hall. We would have been in the basement of a church, fountain, or something like that. Drinks possession. and the um. I was for the open bar though for the couple hours we had it open. Mm -hmm. Um, like I was saying off camera, we we felt we couldn't do open bar the entire time because we both know our people and it well, could we get a little out of hand. Bar a little bit at the time, and it was pretty. That's what I'm saying. It, though. Got, pretty, it, it got real. It got real robust. Uh, yeah. in that thing so um, yeah but so you're saying you enjoyed every part <laughs> of the I had planning. a good time well, well, I'm hearing all this from Jess and you'll hear from my side of you I'm gonna let her say her thing but it was totally different I guess from yeah. my point of view well, did you ever did you feel like Jess when planning the wedding and you know who you were then you're obviously a totally different person now oh, yeah. did you feel that you needed to have this big grandiose thing because Yes. Okay, because I feel like when yeah. weddings are like that, it takes the focus off of you of the people getting married. Yes. And it's more focused on trying to appease everyone else that's there. Yes. So. That is the advice I would give to right. anybody is do not do it for everybody else. Right. Do it for you, even though I'm extra anyway. So it was going to be an extra right. event, but this was a little too extra. And a lot as, of people, a lot, as far as the everybody, people, yeah. and we family were and friends, and we everybody. wanted everybody to be involved. It right. Was, In retrospect, destination. Yeah. If, if, no. Never yeah. again. If I could go back, yeah. some of the best weddings I've been to have been very yeah. small, intimate, not a big production. I mean, our wedding was a production. Like you might as well have They're still good. We should have flown I, in I, via I, helicopter or something yeah. like that. It was bachelorette party. Yeah, bachelor party. I think so. Yeah, yeah, nice. yeah. Okay, I did one. Yeah, yeah, he did. He okay, did. a local one yeah. though. At the time, um, Miss Jessica wasn't a uh, well a traveler, so we didn't travel much at the time. She she had a little phobia of, of flying right. that you got over. Yeah. So, but uh, yeah, at the podcast, time we right? yeah, yeah we just chilled here uh, locally. So nice, that's good. Yeah, yeah. I've never asked him about his bachelor party either. Thank you. I know you're welcome. <laughs> okay, so leading up to the day, of the, let's say okay, the day of the wedding, or actually let's go the day before the wedding. You guys had your rehearsal. I, I, I feel like I assume that went well, right? Did the rehearsal dinner go good? Um, the rehearsal dinner went, it went good. The re the dress rehearsal, yep. the coordinator for the church was sick. So oh. that was a whole thing. That should have like, that should have been an indication of, <laughs> of what was to come after the person that's supposed to coordinate everything was sick. Um, so no, it, it all went well. I think we were just kind of like, okay, the coordinator is not here, so this is what we think we're going to do, and here we go. 
Okay, so we get to the morning of the, the wedding. I don't know if you were up all night kicking it. Were you and the boys? Night before, out, night before, or, um, did we you stay in a hotel. No, we, we, um, I think we all stayed at my house up in Kirkland. Okay. And me and the boys, we might have went out lightweight, but, um, the night before we lightweight. really didn't get after it. But, um, yeah, everybody stayed at my house. We, we drank and probably talked a little crab laugh, uh, blah, say blah. Right. But uh, it was nothing crazy. Okay, so yeah. you guys, the fellas are at your house. Yeah. You guys get ready the next morning. Your morning, I know, is probably starting a lot earlier than his is. Oh, yeah. Okay, so what, how does this go from the beginning? How does the morning go before you even get to, was it a church? Yeah. Okay, so, so before we even got to the church, how'd it go? To back that up even further, um, the night before, my girls and I, my bridesmaids and I, we spent the night in a hotel. What was it? Like Hotel 1000 or something like mm-hmm. that. And I dropped the bomb that I was pregnant. Oh. Right. Nice. Right. Who? Oh. <laughs> yay for being pregnant on your wedding day. Not. So it was like, oh, tee It was like a special moment. And then the next day, I think we got up at like 6 a.m. And uh, the shit show unfolded. Ooh. Starting from there, when we got to the church, um, bridesmaids were crying over their makeup. <laughs> were their makeup messed up, or apparently crying of through them their makeup? Like... Crying through and because of their makeup. One of them is in the bathroom hysterically crying over it. It, it was the pregnant bridesmaid, and um, the what emotions. Else? I know we've talked about this before, right? They Being were... emotional. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Proceed. <laughs> Mr. You call me emotional one more time. Sorry. Sorry. I, I am. You just love hard. It's fine. Right. I'm so not emotional. Anyways, so um, the bridesmaids, the next day, we're all getting ready. One of them the night before had decided to just rearrange the hair that we had all gotten done. They had all gotten done the same. So when my hairdresser came to touch up our hair, one of the bridesmaids told on the other bridesmaid for trying to change her hair. Ratted. That Snitch. started a big fight. Snitching. Um, so remember, there's black mascara crying over makeup. Somebody's crying in the bathroom. They're fighting over hair. Uh, what Are else? they screaming at each other? It, it was loud. It, it got loud. And then one of my bridesmaids busted out of her dress. Completely ripped Wait, now, was this one of the bridesmaids that was in the altercation? No. Okay. No. And um, so it's like, oh, shit. What are we going to do? So the hotel seamstress, shout out to the, oh, what hotel were we at? The Fairmont? Yeah, the yeah. Fairmont. Shout out to the Fairmont for your great hospitality and service. Yeah, it was nice. Um, the hotel seamstress came and literally had to sew her in to her dress to the point where she had to cut out of the metallic dress shiny suit the shiny suit at the end of the night um so yeah so it kind of went like that in the morning and then my mother she forgot my veil (laughs) shout out to Gigi. now i got emotional (laughs) then i got real emotional and that ended up being a fight and then there's bridesmaids trying to de-escalate that they're fighting they're this they're that and then i'm sitting there getting my makeup done and my wedding planner gets a phone call and she kind of looks like, oh my God. And I'm like, what's going on? Is Marcus at the church? He kind of tried to, I don't know. Did you get cold feet for just a second? Nah, like I've. Um... Pause. Okay. No, go. No, but um, no, never got cold feet, but. What happened, Marcus? No stress. Did you intentionally pop the tire? No stress, and to be and, and to take it back, I wasn't driving in that car. Or was I riding in the car? You were with my brother at the but time. You still but done it. but my uh, brother caught a flat tire downtown Seattle. But keep in mind, I'm in a white suit though, white suit. So how 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 many? <laughs> Baggy uh, joint too. It's baggy. It. I, I, you know, you know what I'm about to ask you. <laughs> how many so buttons? How many buttons? You knew I was going to ask was, you. Hey, it was fresh. It was baggy. It, but um, he had braces. Yep, I had bra- I had teeth missing, and I didn't want to have. 
<laughs> gaps in my teeth for my wedding picture. So I had these braces and I told the dentist, yeah, just attach some teeth to the braces and then oh, it'll wow. look just clean. Did you have the braids then? Uh, no. no, I had cut the, myself off. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you didn't have teeth. He had to have a bunch of teeth pulled. Yeah, I had so them he pulled. Had spaces. That's so, right, right, right. And so, yeah. Anyways, and so when, <laughs> right? Don't look back. It's the camera back there. I'm looking at the camera behind you. That's why I was. But uh, yeah. So my um, yeah, the flat tire. I was late, but no stress though. No stress. No and that's stress. just me. We're yeah, yeah. over here in full no World War the, Three over here. Hey, at the groom's party, we kicked you it. You guys were kicking it. Okay, wait, we kicked wait, it. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. wait. No. <laughs> I was told there was a flat tire. I'm freaking out. He, in the back of my head, I'm like, oh, shoot, is this not going to happen? But then I heard it was resolved. And a it glass was all half good. empty. Over here, glass half empty. Always. Yeah. <laughs> Sheesh. But you should see the video of them pulling up to a Catholic church. Beaten, huh? It was still a you wedding. It was still a party. <laughs> what was they listening to? What was you I playing? don't know, but getting out, they were already <laughs> three sheets to the wind at this point. <laughs> we got out the car. And we got yeah. out dancing me, and like, Ugh. Okay, wait. This is 2008. Right. You're from Tacoma. Tag. You were playing Mac Tag. Dre. You pulled up on playing some I Mac Dre, I Mac bet. Dre. Huh? I'm we, not sure what you were playing. I know we played a lot of Mac Dre earlier, and we started drinking nine ish. Mm. Started up in Kirkland. I had the car mm. take us back to Tacoma because that's where it all started. So I wanted to get dressed at, um, in Tacoma. I think we got dressed at O's house. Okay. Oh, no, yes. no, no, no. At a hotel or something in Tacoma. Everybody got ready down there. We, we getting lit, man. We going in. It's a party. Our party is totally different. There's no stress. Everybody's right, having a good right. time. Man, we high five. day, it's a party. Dancing and, I mean, stanky leg and the <laughs> <laughs> thunderclap, a 2008 ish. Yeah, I already know. The oversized yeah. suits. It was going fun. down, man. It was going down. We had a good time, man. And we, we, um, and the boys, they was all, and they was definitely with me. It was nothing negative. Okay, true. Are you the first one out the group and you really about to do this thing. We're behind you. Let's do it. But we're going to party our way out of it, though. We're going to party our way out of it. <laughs> <laughs> we go party our way out of it But we had the um, Got dressed man I Tied a few of my boys ties A couple of my guys Didn't know how to tie ties And different stuff like that <laughs> Everybody was in black I was the only one in white I had the white And the uh, hot pink tie My guys had the all black White shirts with the pink tie I thought we was fresh And everybody had shades and yep, shades like, cute shades though I think, Like um, ugly shades And this Did I have old, Cole, is, best man? I think my two brothers were Cole. Yeah, 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 yeah. So and this is 08, so glasses you guys are probably wearing Ray-Bans, Wayfarers. Because that's when that's, like that's, that's, that's Anything. What was Yeah. Shades in the building, okay, though. Okay, so I'm seeing now the day and night of the two parties. So yeah, two the, totally the groomsmen party, it's you guys are it's lit. Love and light. The ladies, you We're guys in distress. are distress. We're it's like full in on distress full mode. Distress here. Do you feel like Jessica, the reason why some of the ladies may have reacted the way that they did to the hair, the makeup, because just, their dresses? Not the dresses, oh. but they wanted to try so hard to impress you and make sure that you weren't upset with them because you have a. Th listen, you have an. You have a. Uh, uh, Be careful, Kale. Before no, 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 you, no, no, you no, 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 no. What's the thing? No, listen. <laughs> nah, listen. Because you are a very, very strong a personality yes. woman. Yes, definitely. Okay. Alpha. E exactly. So, and I don't know these ladies at all, but like some of them may have, may not have been like intimidated by that. No. And they don't want to disappoint <laughs> you, especially on your special day. Cause no. this is your day, right? It was not about, it me. wasn't, think it was, about this. So a bridesmaid in a wedding might be single, might be near single. They're trying, they're like, Hey, you never know what's out here. I'm trying true. to look my best. I'm about to make a little change up in here type stuff. So I don't think it was Skyway. about. <laughs> Skyway-ish. I don't think it was necessarily about me. It was like, I need to look my best. And so when it wasn't, you think they're crying over their makeup because of me? Well, no. I'm, well, well, no. What not. I'm saying is this, though, is A, let's be real, Jessica. You can be very fucking scary when you want to be. 
And some of them might not have wanted to feel that wrath on top of the fact that, oh, shit, our homegirl's marrying a fucking NFL player. Yep. There's about to probably be. That's even uh, more. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, I might be like, getting saved up in this piece. Hey. You know what I'm saying? I just so got to be on my too, best I think, behavior. Right? Yeah, like. Oh, right yeah, before, yeah, yeah. just, just signed my new contract yeah. and all that. Yeah, so yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so I pocket. get it. Like people are trying to impress people because they're like, "Well, I'm in the wedding party, so right. I'm important." I don't know. Right, I don't know, but it was okay. So you're you finally get ready. You finally get to the church. Okay, when you get to the church, since you were obviously three sheets to the wind, what do you remember? I remember. Um, Catholic Church. Um, Which one? Immaculate Conception. You got married at Immaculate? Mm -hmm. Immaculate Conception. My family's members of Immaculate. Really? I yeah. was there for 20 Knights years. and Ladies of St. Peter Claver, baby. I was a junior Beautiful knight. Beautiful church. I was a junior knight back in the day. Uh -huh. Beautiful uh -huh. church. Small world. You know Mr. and Mrs. Davidson? Yeah. Damn it, that's my grandparents. They're dead now. Prob but. Oh, God. Probably, though. <laughs> Probably. Probably, yeah. Okay, sorry. We had a pretty morbid. And, but, but yeah, yeah um, beautiful <laughs> church. I don't really know much about, you know. The, Oldest the, Catholic church in the state yeah, of Washington. I don't know anything about yeah. Catholic church. Yeah. So, um, yeah, get there. <laughs> Man, and me and the boys and just being boys, being from Tacoma, doing what we do. Um, going to the back room, bringing bottles in, if I remember correctly. We brought <laughs> bottles in to the back room well, um, you were drinking discreetly in, in the immaculate conception well don't get it twisted catholics do get down on all <laughs> kinds of wine. jesus drank wine right and uh listen i'm a reformed catholic so <laughs> trust me it don't bother me none right. but like y'all snuck in y'all brought the bottles into immaculate but yeah. it was cool no man. i think yeah, it's yeah. great go ahead yeah. low-key all positive man and we go to the back room and we do our thing and um he was swaying during the vows pretty much Right, but before that, though, and he I had, put my yeah. ring on the wrong finger. I did, and I think I gave him the wrong hand on top yeah. of it. Yeah, wrong hand, wrong finger. How about that? that goes back to the practice, and not knowing, though. Hey, I was a young kid, not really no. twenty six ish. No. <laughs> yeah, hey. twenty seven. No, you you had rehearsal the night before. You knew it. Ring, but remember, but rehearsal it really go. wasn't it rehearsal didn't go though. Like we thought it was going to go. So we were freestyling, kind I of. I think uh, even the exchange yeah. didn't go right with my dad. It was, it, you know. And when nobody told me at a Catholic wedding, though, is that I was going to be up there for Hella. so long, though. <laughs> yeah. And I had been drinking all day, so I kind of got the, you know, yeah, I got the sways, and I'm trying to balance and. Not only me, it's me and the rest of my groomsmen. Right. But, uh, but like I said, though, we, we're all positive. It's love and light. Right. We, we really was, you know, okay, let's, let's get, to the, uh, they get to the reception. Yeah, this is love. I love this woman. And, you know, the ring and the families and the kids. Because we had a daughter at the right. time that was one and some change. She, she was, was the flower two. girl. She was, she was two. Two? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Two-ish. Uh-huh. So when... You were walking down the aisle. Um, did you? Did did you? Were you, did you have to like focus in? No, nah, you like? Oh. Yeah, no. Nah. I was like, hey, okay, Ooh. yes, yeah. And there's people. And then, and then, then focusing in. Oh, and then, and then the, right. the the the. I guess the mishaps you'd say that happened. Would anyone else had noticed that Not really. wasn't in, I don't that so. wasn't in the wedding party? No, no. no. Okay, so that yeah, it didn't yeah, happen. it went off well for everybody else that was there, and that's what Jessica talked about early. The wedding was more for more for the masses. People they they say yeah, the the the, the steak, steak at the reception. Neither was, one of us ate. Was excellent. We didn't have time to eat. Yeah, didn't we were have busy time greeting, to eat. The entertaining, you talking to people. Seventy five pe people that we didn't know, right. pretty much. You guys had 375 people Something like at that. the reception. Yeah. It's at the reception. The wedding was more. So and it was people outside, like it was the club. Like, true, man, I'm trying to. We had an after hours. It was good, man, I'm trying to get I, in. I, I guess I have a question. We had an after hours. So how many people do you would you say you guys officially invited, and then how many people just <laughs> showed up? Well, you know, there's. I think this, it was 320, 350. We officially invited maybe 100 people. How many people did we invite? And the extras came from outside. You know, we've got mom we have to please. We've got mother-in-law. And their we friends to, and stuff. We've got all yeah. these things. So it ended up being I had a my, whole um, bunch. Uh, people from New Orleans came down. I think yes. some people from Texas came down. All yes. my folks came down. The Trufants was thick. But the Johnsons big, was it thick. Was a big so to it, do. Yeah. it was yeah. for everybody else. Where'd you guys have the reception at? The Fairmont. 
That's Fairmont. The Fairmont. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so Stunning. we get through the wedding. Yes. How are you feeling about your dress, your heels? You're pregnant at this time. You're going to you take know, the pictures. Good? You guys hey, take pictures. You remember pictures? that? And we go through downtown. Right. The Seattle. And- right. Well, it. I was like, hey, you can't tell me nothing. Once again, in hindsight, I'm like, dang, Jess. Mm. But, um, and, you know, speaking of ripping out dresses, like my final fitting, they actually had to let the back out of my dress. Really? Yeah, because I had gained weight. Oh, because you're pregnant. Because I was pregnant, right. I wasn't pregnant enough to gain weight, but I still (laughs) did anyway. Anyways, um, yeah, so they totally had to let, but you couldn't tell me anything. I was like, I was the shit. Yeah. So then we, do I tell that story Mm -hmm. about when we were in the car? So we're yep. in the car on yeah. the way to yeah, Pike Place Market to take our pictures, and I'm cramping, and I look down, and there's blood on my dress. <gasps> what? Right. There's what? blood on my dress, and suddenly I'm like, I have to use the bathroom. I've got this big dress on. So there's blood on the dress. I'm freaking out in the car. I'm like, Marcus, I think I'm having a miscarriage. I'm like in between you know, euphoria still and tears and I have to potty. So as soon as we get to Pike Place, the hunt begins for a bathroom. Did you have to go downstairs in Pike Place? Somewhere. And Marcus had to follow me in, help me. And I was at this point, I'm like, if I pee on myself, nobody's going to notice because my dress is so big. (laughs) But I had just... I was like, all right, I'm just going to wet my pants. Did your, did your cool. dress, did it not unclip? Did you not the type to take the whole I actually had off? a whole separate dress made for the reception that I never wore. Oh, but the okay. back of it, I was able to like hook it. Okay. But it, we weren't there yet. Gotcha. Right? It, gotcha. it wasn't there. So he is in the bathroom pulling up my dress. Good man, good man, good man, good man. Holding it. So I do I what I do. Bathroom. Still in the back of my head, I'm like, oh my God, I'm still having a miscarriage. I'm like freaking out, like doing all these things. And so then when we get, when did I realize? I don't know. Was it when we got, no, it was before we even got back to the hotel for the reception. My flowers had little red um, buds and they had bled on my dress. I'm over here building up all this damn suspense. I'm like, holy shit. You know what I'm saying? And then she didn't. But this is all a part of the the full fuckery of the whole day, right? Glass half empty. And it was sunny when we went. Yes. When we first got to the church, it rained. It snowed all on our wedding day. Rain, snowed, and sunshine. Wow. Yeah. 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 I just said that. The Holy Trinity. Okay. okay, okay. All right. (laughs) So you guys take pictures. You get to the reception. They're cleaning off my my dress. Club soda. So you didn't you didn't switch into the other dress. No. Once again, since they had to let the back out of one dress, I'm like, you know what? There ain't no point in wearing this other dress because it was really tight and short. And I'm like, yeah, no, not today. Okay. Not today. All right. So we get to the Fairmont. Yep. We get to the Fairmont for the reception. Um, Open bar is still going. Open bar is going there. We had a martini hour. Oh. Which. Was that a terrible idea? Kind of. Because my bridesmaids got Hmm. in on it. And so then it was their turn. And then his people were still going, right? So they have been drinking since God knows when. Go we to the started at like hour. about 9 a.m. Right. Drinking. They're still... Not really eating either. I'm not sure no. why. Did anyone I guess we forgot. Um, I don't think no, so. Yeah. I didn't, know. Yeah. No, They're yeah, still yeah, no. tearing it down. So it comes time for our first dance. This is great. You're twitching. What happened? This is great. So yeah. we're on the... And it, to Mia... And um, Eric Benet spend my life with you. And so Marcus and I are dancing. This is our moment. This is when you have arrived as a couple. First of all, we walked into Party Like a Rock Star and we thought we Maybe were with the, the absolute little snappy thing. shit. Right. Back yeah. then, that was the. Right, that was the it. Sna- throw it up and then. We didn't catch do, it. Did we do that? Uh, did nah. we catch it? <laughs> I think I don't that was think after so. 2008. Anyways, yeah. so we're doing our first dance, you know. What, what are the lyrics? And I see you every morning when I open my eyes. Uh. And all of a sudden, I hear, hey, hey, the whole bridal party is like up and like, hey, like it's their first dance. So are your parents like, yo, these niggas need to shut up (laughs) while our babies is dancing? They never shut up. Were they just hammered? 
Yes, at that point. So as soon as we're done. You guys need new <laughs> fucking friends. You want to talk about scary? God I walked damn. right over. And mind you, we're on a platform, all, <laughs> all of the bridesmaids, and we're like on like one tier up. I walk up and I cuss them all out. And then they get mad at me. I'm like, you know, yeah, I had a lot of choice words for them. I'm like, how dare you guys do this? And blah, 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 and went off on them. I'm sure some other people might have seen that moment. But I don't know. I don't care. It was so, your yeah. wedding. It was my wedding. But yeah. And then from there, it continued. Okay. So the first dance <laughs> happens and your friends, if I don't know if I'll ever meet any of your friends, but they ruin it. Uh, and are we eating at this point? We couldn't or you guys, are, you guys are too busy greeting people. We're people greeting. Are, they're okay. coming up. I think the food was out. Over. The food was getting passed right. out at that time. So oh, yeah. we're getting deeper into the night. Drinks are still flowing. People are still drinking. What happens? You know what? Wait, wait. And I'll, people wait. are looting. I need looting. So Let me, what? <laughs> yes. Hold on. Go ahead. Wait. Tell, the, tell the story. How do, people, how do people loot at a wedding? I'm very confused. carefully. Shout out to Kelby, who still has a napkin, a big crystal. We had big crystals that we had rented. You know, rented. They weren't napkin gifts. Rings. They yeah, weren't they weren't gifts. gifts but everybody took. Friends they were ghetto. They were taking and putting them in their purse, wearing the napkin ring as a ring. Yeah, we had to pay for that. Are these were these her friends? It was a little bit of both. It was a little bit of both. Yeah, right. Skyway, Ren, Tacoma. You know, yeah, we this get is what happens when you have a Skyway and Tacoma yeah, wedding. It was what a little. Happens when yeah, the two Jesus. Get together. God, the South End and Tacoma <laughs> come together. You get this debauchery, right? Okay, so, um. What else happens? Because I've heard I heard a fight broke out. I missed a fight. Allegedly, I think. yeah, yeah. Did I miss? There were several. Yeah, fights there was a couple. There were reception. several fights at the open reception. bar. That's what happened. Open martini yeah, hour. There were several. Fights. Sometimes, that, like yeah. physical fights, like someone got punched in the face. <laughs> open hand, open, open hand, hand oh, slaps open hand. and stuff. You know, so disrespectful. Not a big deal. Um, and. Screaming matches, I assume, were the other two. I I don't know if they were screaming matches, but it was definitely we're leaving. Get up, we're we're leaving the wedding. And allegedly, some X-rated. There was um, some extracurricular allegedly, activities. Allegedly, that happened. allegedly, did somebody have sex in the bathroom at allegedly, your wedding? I yeah. I, I, allegedly, I don't I don't make the rules, yeah. and I, I, I yeah. do you do you know who it is? Or have I have idea who it is. I don't. I don't have any idea. I'm not sure. Okay. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> I don't know. know. Oh, and it wasn't us, by the way. Oh, it was right. not yeah, us. So you, know. you guys had a fight. You guys had people. Sounds like a good party to me, though, you, right? I'm saying you guys had fights. You had people crushing cheeks in the bathroom. Oh, my god. We had goodness. people on all fours on our stage. And who was that? Shout oh, out to Auntie. That was hey, your auntie. Aunt? <laughs> Oh, your it's a party on all it's fours, doing leg lifts like she's doing a James early twerk. Fonda this is before twerk video. was really a no, thing. No, twerk was so, Marcus. A thing. So she, Marcus, Marcus, she was on stage. everybody came to party. Tacoma fours. came out. We were showing out. Oh, so you're <laughs> very aware of that. Hey, uh, your, your auntie was busting it open on stage at your wedding, bro. Yep. And I don't take it back. Hey, she, did I she said have, good job. Hey, Cheers. She had fun. Yes, yeah, she did. All right. Yeah, like, hey, hey. She had fun, right? Uh, clearly, she had fun. <laughs> Jeez. But yeah, so at the end, of, and then like the VIP or the VIP, the outside people at 10, we let people that weren't invited to the wedding or the reception. Wait, it was like the club for real. I was like, in. So people yeah. were like, yo, I heard that this is where the true fun was. Can somebody go in. get true? Like, we had a list. I'm out here. Like, there's, was like I'm a trying to get in. And they, yes. Yes. Man, so, did you, have, did you have, have one of your partners stand no. at the door and be like, all yeah. right, yeah, yeah. I had security. In. I think I yeah. had security there. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. 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 So, okay. But that. it worked out. I mean, there's people I know. I couldn't let everybody in, but some of the cats I knew. Okay. Yeah. yeah. You look at this shit and get shot up. Right. So it was nice, and I don't even remember. Was how it we, nice? Well, kind of. It was. It was nice for everybody else. I mean, it's a fun. It's a funny story. It is funny. Went to talk about it now because it's almost unreal. Like, did all of this really happen? On and your you only know day? what you know. Yes. Well, we, you know, I keep saying we was kids. We wasn't, but we, we didn't. Were kids. I didn't know nothing about. But I think, I, honestly, Marcus, I think outside of 
the metallic dresses and you getting hammered. Wait, I, th- I think everything else wasn't in. I got one more control. thing. So now we forgot. No, it wasn't. One more thing. What did you? For- you um, I had on all white, right? The throat, all white with the uh, hot pink it suit. No, uh, Good for you. But I. For the recession, I had got this white hat, similar to what Jessica got on, but not really, like a, a man's version of that, right? But nobody told me I had it on backwards. The whole reception. <laughs> I'm hammered, so I got my backwards. hat. It got this, like, dip in it in the front, and ain't nobody like say nothing. Hat. Nobody say the nothing. I'm taking pictures. It. I'm like, you look, geez, yeah, man, I'm just, doing it. It's my wedding. Man, I got my hat on. I done changed up, man, for the reception. <laughs> Just, did it look like he had a woman's floppy like yes, shirt hat on? Yes, yeah. it looked like it a women's floppy hat. Had it on backwards. Hat. Yes. And I'm upset. And I, once again, I, you couldn't tell him anything I still either. look at the pictures now like, yeah, damn, damn. nobody say nothing. I, I knew I was killing them then, but it, it Ooh, I mean. Kill him. Kill him then, you killed yourself, brother. <laughs> right. Right. But just that's how the day went, man. It was a lot of stuff, but um, a lot of love in the air still, though. There was a lot of love. A lot of love in the air. A lot right. of family, um, friends. It was a big step. I was the first out of my friends to uh, to jump the broom. So that's yeah. what it was, right. man. And Question. I think I was, a, I was the how, second. How many videographers did you guys have there? One oh, or two? I don't know. Because if I were you, I would get hold of all of the unedited footage because there's Uncut. probably yeah there's probably I think we some. gotta let that die no, we gotta let that die some shit on there I, know, I think right? we had one to two of them probably yeah 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 there's... two probably yeah. Yeah. yeah we got a lot of good pictures yeah and like so, I said I'm gonna send you some pictures we're gonna post some pictures of please of the, I am of the wedding you. I would prefer not to but, I know okay, but yeah so afterwards we had the hotel room we stayed at um, the W and it was oh, nice. new then oh it was when the W yes. had first got built yes yeah. and we had like uh, Dick's Burgers delivered. We had a cooler of like our favorite sodas, our favorite candies. I had we the chocolate had chocolate milk and the donuts and shit because you know that's my right. Krispy Kreme. Of course, you had your fucking milk. <laughs> right, and so we whole get milk. It, we ugh. it was whole milk. I'm pretty know. positive know. it was whole milk, right? Hey. So we get into the room and we're like, yeah. He goes to sleep. Just passed straight out. Straight to bed. Like, didn't pass go, collect 200 Done. Wait, how long were you in the room? Wait, because you were asleep. Jess, how long were you in the room until he, he passed out? Was he still Don't in the suit? Don't put no extras on it, it was, either. Just, just it was me. pretty immediate, actually. Was he in the suit still? And he just, I think oh, so. Yeah, I think he I might was. have still <laughs> been in the suit. In suit. <sighs> no sexy time? Nope. That's Did, fine. Next morning? Yep. Are you? Yeah, okay. Yeah, cause, and then I got him back, though. I started crying because we were, once again, I didn't fly at the time. So we had booked a room at the Salish and I started crying the next day. And I said, I want to see my daughter. I didn't get to see her. He was not happy. So we had to go to my mom's house so I could see my daughter. See our daughter. I know. I know. And you're ready to go to Salish Lodge? Yeah. And go to the falls and go do your thing. I kind of hate the Salish too. I don't know. Why would you say Shout out to the Salish though they they are treated you, us are well. Are you not a fan of the Salish? <laughs> well, it, it's um the food isn't good. You got to be I in like the right it. mood for that. Yeah. There's really nothing going on out there. I mean, nothing you, going on. You got the there. falls and the ambience of the water and the the uh, you, and the you falls. have falls, the ambience of the water, and maybe some old railroad tracks you can go <laughs> look at. That's what's over there. Well, we yeah. didn't even stay the full time. We yeah, were no. supposed to stay for like three days, and we stayed for a day i think and then we went and bought a house there you go we left to go look at a house and we bought it there you go yep that's that was bothered. a newcastle joint yeah okay yeah so that was our wedding our wedding and yeah that yep mm-hmm. but, but i feel like you guys married. you guys made it up when you renewed your vows yes and you did it the way that you because guys we didn't take a honeymoon wanted to either do it. that was our honeymoon the salish and we didn't take a honeymoon Really? Either the Salish. Who needs a honeymoon when you're pregnant? It's your fear of flying is the reason. Right. Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. 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 I so was like, you know. Well, what's your fear of flying? And not anymore. But Wait, where did, then, it was just a did thing. you have a bad incident on the plane? Or? Nope. I think it was. Um, I don't know. I don't really don't know what happened. But I can tell you after nine eleven, 
I was done. I was like, nope, not flying really? ever again in life. Well, that's a whole nother podcast. I wrote a blog about that, about when I flew to, we went to Vegas and Marcus was fucking around and we missed our flight and on the way home, right on the way back. Um, and, um, I wouldn't leave Vegas. Oh, wow. I didn't make us miss the flight. We were all sitting down eating. No. And I'm talking like this because I'm remaining Our calm. Our friends got wow. up, went, and he's still sitting there. Let me finish this that food. People are getting a little excited, but we were eating. Everybody's sitting down. I was maybe one or two minutes behind the rest of the group. They left. I had practice the next day, right? Why I had you to get your voice. Like, why are you getting all? Calm? Why are you trying to make me look crazy? No, well, I had to get back for practice, right, and make right. sure I was back for practice because. Um, right. But um, Jessica chose to stay um, because there were what, because we would have had to get on different flights. Well, at first it right. was. <laughs> first of all, I had popped a Xanax because that was when I first started flying, and my doctor was like, "Here." Take a Xanax. Take a Xanax and go to sleep. So I took a Xanax before I thought I was going to board the plane. And when we missed our flight, I'm hysterically crying and sleeping at the same time because I'm drugged up. And it, it started off with, okay, we missed our flight. Okay, let's try and get on the next flight. Nope, that didn't happen. Two people offered to give their seats. And we were like, yeah. And this was like, what, four hours later? Mm. And then somehow that didn't pan out. So I'm back to crying and sleeping at the same time. And then it became, you're going to have to go from Vegas to pretty much Alaska, <laughs> back to Texas, and then to Seattle. So it became like an eight-hour travel just to get back to Seattle. And I was like... Oh, shoot, this is my, I'm going to die. It's in the cards. I'm going to die. This is how it plays out. I refuse to get on the plane. <sighs> you could have got back faster driving. We thought about that, I think. And so Marcus ended up, he had to leave. He got on the last flight and I stayed and I am crying. People are staring at me. And I run into one of his teammates that was getting on, I think, the same flight as him and he was like, I have the hookup at this hotel. I call my mom and my mom's like, I'm on my way. Aww. So she grabs my daughter. She flies down to Vegas with my daughter. She's two and she flies me back. Wow. Yeah. I would have done what like, you did. I would have got on that plane and been like, I had to. You had I to mean, get I back. Couldn't, yeah. I mean, unless I want to. You left me. I did. You left me alone in Vegas. I did. So I you're just sitting in McCarran I didn't want to take just the fine. dozing off crying. Yeah. Just, ah, yeah. just dozing ah. and crying. Yeah. Knees to my chest, just in the corner up against the wall, knowing, just crying. Knowing that there's probably people that are looking at her like, man, she oh. must have lost it all. But I know they were. And I didn't even, I couldn't you even didn't even gamble. That. Nope. So yeah. Okay, so. That was a whole Okay, story. so what would you guys do different about that <laughs> crazy wedding of yours everything i wouldn't be pregnant for starters okay first Metallic, things first first things first. dresses yeah um less people the destination is what i'm thinking maybe destination mm -hmm. yeah maybe i still like the frills though the cool thing about destination weddings I mean, if this matters, it's like it's all inclusive at a right. lot of places. And it's, so you don't have to think about a lot of stuff. They take care right. of it for right. you. You just show up. And it's up. the people that really want to be there. Right. Because gonna, like I said, right, when you do a come. local wedding, it's more for the people. Like and that's said, okay. Was yeah. The, it was people outside. Club, like it was the club. Like, yeah, in. I'm trying to get in. I'm trying to, you know, I mean, there's two people out. I mean, there's two people in type of thing. Right. You know what I'm saying? But, um, a destination would have been nice, but you only know what you know, man. We, right. I wanted to make this lady happy, of course, so I had to, um, man, I had to do what I was told, man. I had to pull out all the stops, man, hey, and make man, it work, society, and, and I was good with that. Hey, what? Man. hey, listen, society puts in the mind of women of this crazy idea of what their wedding is supposed to be like, and so that's why you have a lot of these crazy extravagant weddings, and it's not even the lady's fault, it's just the fact that they've been fed their whole lives, like, when you get married, you right. have this big blah, 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 blah. But not even hey, that. Don't get it, it twisted, yeah. because I've seen some dudes that have been yeah, just and that's as true too. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, Because They're the absolutely. wedding is made to be this... Groomzilla... <laughs> The wedding That's is so made to be this thing, no. Like, it's not so much about the wedding. It's really about, well, 
it's it's the wedding is about it's, the YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The wedding is, the about, wedding is about the two, but the two people. The people get lost in the flair and right. everything that comes with it, and right. it has to be this and right. You know, I wanted that for her though, and I wanted that for me too. And oh, we kind of like, just if you don't stop. But you did want all the, the flair, and I wasn't so much into the, all the flair. But uh, I did it. Here's, here's the thing, Jess. This. Jess, listen, <laughs> Jess. Here's the thing. The reason why you won't win this debate is because you had metallic silver dresses, hey, okay? Hey. And metallic silver dresses, hey. that's extra as on a whole But I let her do it, though. Extra. I let her do it, and that's my thing. What are you talking about? You let me do... Do I have <laughs> I, to come across this space? I want her to be happy. Do I have to not social distance anymore? She's taking it wrong now, but I want her to be happy. So anything she wants, anything she... Even if it's space suits for wedding dresses? Even this is moon suits. He had no... I think he thought they were great. I didn't mind. Can you guys send me this picture of the wedding party so I can like put it on the Truly page? I got to find the video. I got to find the video. My caption will be like... You know, what men, not to do. men and Martians. I don't know, like something. I'm gonna find the videos. I think do. I know what, what a, I know where the DVD is of our uh, D- we have a DVD. 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 Oh, I know. You know what Lord saw, Jesus, you guys know something crazy. I saw a Blu-ray. This is so off topic, <laughs> but because <laughs> you brought up DVD player, I saw a Blu-ray player for seventy dollars. Remember when Blu-ray players were like five hundred bucks? Yep. Isn't that crazy the time we live in now? I so, might need to see what that... Uh, it was on Amazon. Okay. And right. I was like, oh, what are you gonna do? everyone streams everything, but I yeah. just thought since you brought up DVDs... I'd still be buying DVDs at Safeway and stuff. You well, check out and you car. see a DVD? Yeah. You got DVDs yeah. in the car the and stuff Yeah, they got Blu-ray players. Yeah. Blu-ray $73, brother, on Amazon. I might mm. need that. Mm-hmm. Okay, so... Okay, so you guys' wedding sounded like a very, very unique experience. We didn't talk about different. the ice sculptures and the food and the drinks and the name of the drinks. Like, oh, you guys, did you guys name the drinks yourselves? The, yeah. I can't remember, but we had the true. Now don't something. bring it up if you can't remember because I, I don't know. remember either. I know. But we also point? had fortune cookies at the oh, end that cool. we gave out, and when you cracked them open, it was like Jessica or. I don't know. The true fonts did it. We're married. Yeah, baby. Or something like that. Yeah. It was really, it was really cute. That's cool. At that was what, their parting gift as well as what they stole. Go ahead. At, at, <laughs> what, at what point would you say, Marcus, did you black out? Did you black out at any point? I blacked out <laughs> probably on the elevator ride up okay. to the room. You don't remember anything really after that? No. Great okay. time though. Great, yeah, great time. Yeah, you, you know, um, was the wobble alive then? We the, wobble the wobble was alive then. We were, and and that was my thing. If that song came on, and you hey, know, big oh, girl, hey, let's back go. It up. Hey. Yeah, yeah. Look, let's go. Yeah, so that's, that, all you, yeah. that's all you remember. Is. That was my thing. Wow. So the 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 reception, all the, the wobble. friends, everybody, me and the wife on the dance floor. That was that was my thing. Just having a good time, man. I'm I'm a good, I'm a let the good times roll type of guy. Mm. So and you fall asleep mm. in your suit. Yeah. And that's he'd okay. do it again. Hey, that's okay. Jess, that's his favorite. When phrase. when he do fell asleep in his suit, did you start crying again? No. Okay. Did you just take your dress like, off? Like I'm gonna go to bed. Don't you know I sat there and went through all that food by myself. <laughs> <laughs> I had the best time. I'm like watching TV, eating, eating donuts, Dick's burgers eating and Dick's stuff. Burgers. I'm like, yeah, and you're sleeping. I had some old fashioned donuts in there. That I, that's a that's the part I regret. I I I didn't get to enjoy my old fashioned donuts and my chocolate milk, milk that I had in the, the cooler donuts. with ice and such, and it yeah, was like literally on point. Cooler. And the Dick's burgers and everything was set up. It was perfect. But all right, damn, damn. All right. Well, that, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> is the true font wedding. That is that is about. I look here on my time, fifty minutes of 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 insanity. I know we left some stuff out effery. too. I mean, yeah. there. I'm sure. Yeah, there was we a left lot. Some stuff out too. I love it. Truly unruly episode eight. This was good. You guys had an insane wedding, but look where that wedding has led you look to at now. Us. We're. So you're still, still married. Still together. Still together. Still married. Five beautiful kids. A, yep. a beautiful family. A beautiful years, home. Right? Everything is good. So it worked oh, out at the end. Even though 13. it rained, it snowed, Sunshine. and it was sunny yeah. mm-hmm. on your wedding. Yep. 
All right, episode five. Check us out, uh, Marcus Trufant's uh, YouTube channels where you can watch us. You can you can listen to us on Apple Podcasts, Podcast One, Spotify. Follow us, Truly Unruly underscore Podcast. Follow Marcus Trufant on Instagram. Follow Fab Five Mom. We gotta always do this. Fab V Mom. Yeah, Marcus underscore Trufant. Do I always get that wrong? Do I get that wrong? Do I get that wrong? No, no, no. I think that's the first time. And follow me, Radio Kells. Hey. Hey. No, um, but yeah, until next time, this was fun, you guys. Truly on Rully, baby. Holler, cheers.